Welcome you all to Math Bridges Fun with Math. In this video, let's learn how to do long division using some mnemonics. Like here you can see dad, mom, sister, brother and Rover. So what it is about and how this helps us to do the long division quickly. Let's see the mnemonic. It is dad, mom, sister, brother and Rover. You can repeat along with me once. Dad, mom, sister, brother and Rover. Rover is a pet dog. Dad, he divides. First step. Here each person represents the step what we are doing in the division process. So D for divide. Whatever daddy he brings, he will divide everything in the sense the salary, whatever he is getting. It has been given for your education, for picnic, for groceries, etc. Like M for mom. Mom multiplies. She multiplies everything, whatever has been given. M for multiply. This is the second step in the long division. Third one, sister, S. Means third step is subtract, minus. B, brother. Means you have to bring it down. B for bring it down. And R, rover. Rover means it is repeat or it's a reminder. You have to repeat the division process or the division process is not going on. You can stop it over there. So, we will follow these steps. Divide, multiply, subtract, bring it down and repeat. Or reminder. Again, you can remember dad, mom, sister, brother and rover. Let's do the long division using one example. 74 divided by 2 is how much? Here you all know 74 is the dividend and 2 is the divisor. Now, we will write like this. And inside this, we will write the dividend. 74, 74. And outside, towards the left hand side, we will write 2. Now, we will use our mnemonic. What is that one mnemonic? You can say along with me, dad, mom, sister, brother and rover. No need to write that. Means It means first step is divide, next multiply, subtract, bring down and repeat or you get reminded, you can stop. Now, 2. That means we are using here 2 multiplication table. Here, if you see in 74, the highest place value digit is 7 here. Tens place. Once tens. So tens is the highest one. So we will start with 7. You recite 2 table till you get 7. But it will not go. 7 we won't get in 2 table. So you take the number which is closer to 7. Less than 7 but not more than 8. 7 or less than 7 we should consider. We will write the table and check. 2 1s are 2. 2 2s are 4. 2 3s are 6. 2 4s are 8. Now, if you see here, you can't take 8 because it is more than 7. So, what we will consider? We consider 2 times 3 is 6. Already here 2 is there. So, 2 times how much? Here you write 2 times 3 towards your right hand side here. Red color you can see 3 is how much? 6. 6 you should write it exactly under 7. Because we are considering for 7 now. Now next step multiplication is over multiply. Third step is what? Subtract. You subtract now. 7 minus 6 is how much? 1. Over subtract step. Next step is what? Bring down. What we should bring down? The number which is there besides. Now what is that number? 4. So bring down 4. So how much it is? 14. Now again repeat the process. Same method how we have done above. Recite 2 table till you get 14. Let's check. 2 5s are 10. 2 6s are 12. 2 7s are 14. Exactly we got. So 2 times 7 is 14. Already 2 is here. So 2 times 7 this side is how much? 14 here. The alignment should be proper under 7, 6. What you are subtracting exactly under that you should write. It's called alignment. Now 14 minus. Next step. Subtract. Minus. How much it is? 0. Now, bring it down. Is there any number to bring it down here? 74. 7 is over. 4 is over. There is no number. So, you have to stop it. This will be your remainder. The meaning is. And 37 is your quotient. And 0 is your reminder. You can practice this kind of sums. Writing the mnemonic. Initially, write the table. For 5 to 6 terms, write the table. Later, once you master this, you can do it directly. You can recite the table in your mind and you can do it. 
Now let's take one more example. 197 divided by 3. Same as it is. Take this like this. Inside 197 dividend should be written. And outside left hand side 3. So it is based on which table now? 3 table we will consider. Mnemonic. Divide, multiply, subtract, bring down and repeat or remainder. So now see 1. 1 stands 100 places 1. But 1 will not go in 3 table. So what we will do now, you consider two digits now. We have to consider two digits. That is 19 we will consider. Now recite three table. Three ones are three. Three twos are six. Three threes are nine. Three fours are twelve. What we should consider? Equal to 19 or less than 19, which is closer to 19. Still we'll write. Three fives are 15. Three sixes are 18. Three sevens are 21. Now you see. Will you write 21 or 18? Question to yourself. 21 we can't write because it will be more than 19. So we consider 18. 18 is closer to 19. So how many times? 3 times 6 is 18. Already 3 is here. So we will write here 6. Is how much? 18. 18 should be written under 19. Multiply over. Now what you will do? Subtract. Next step. 19 minus 18 is 1. Here 1 minus 1 0. Now next step is bring down. What we will bring down? This 7. Bring down 7 here. Now again repeat the process. Bring down, repeat. Now still two numbers are there. It will go in three tables. So we will repeat the same method. See here. 3 4s are 12. 3 5s are 15. 3 6s are 18. Which one we should take? 12, 15 or 18? Which is closer to 17. Less than 17, it will be 15. 3 fives are 15. Already 3 is here. So this side we will write 5. 3 times 5 is 15. 15 here. Now subtract. 17 minus 15 is 2. Now you see here, is there any number to write here to bring it down? Subtraction is over. Third step. Bring down. Is there any number to bring down? No number. So our division is completed. Done. So, this 2 is the reminder and 65 is the quotient. Do it very slowly. Write the table. I have chosen here red color. Instead of that, you circle the number. Write it step by step. You go very slowly for 3 to 5 sums. Later, you can do it very easily. I gave few division problems over here for practice. You take your rough copy. Take pencil or pen, whatever is available. Note on each question. First 81 divided by 3. Do it. Write 3 table. Recite and do it very carefully. Baby, 345 divided by 5. Here you can see 784 divided by 7. This you should write it like D bit, C or B bit. Like this you have to write and do division. So before doing, you should know the multiplication table of 3, 5, 6 and 7 perfectly and 4 also. So learn the tables. Once you get the tables, you can memorize and you can visualize which number you can write it over here. Thank you for watching the video. Like, share and subscribe to my channel. Math Bridges Fun with Math.